6 o'clock, that federal bribery investigation of ComEd is angering a West Chicago family. They are seeking justice after two men were electrocuted near one of ComEd's power poles. One of them died. Dana Revick reports. We lost someone who we forever have to live without. Jordan will forever have to live figuring out whether he'll work again, figuring out whether he'll have children. Losing his arms and his uncle in a horrific tragedy in Sterling, Illinois, nearly four years ago. While they were stringing Comcast cable and this guy wire came loose, it made contact with an energized power line and Robert died a horrific death and Jordan suffered catastrophic injuries. I wouldn't wish this on anybody. I, I wouldn't. The Zulofs are suing ComEd, claiming an insulator or Johnny ball that would have prevented the arcing was installed too high, not below the live wires, and remained that way for nearly 50 years. The Illinois Commerce Commission, in charge of regulating utility companies, never cited ComEd for the violation. How and why could the ICC allow this monolithic entity that's given a monopoly, basically, in Northern Illinois to go 48 years and not and allow this unbelievably dangerous situation to exist. I love my job. I didn't want to do anything else. Worked with my uncle. Just love my job. And working with his uncle, a father of three who would have celebrated his wedding anniversary with wife Jeanette this past weekend. I could not even fathom another family feeling like this. So we just want justice. Dana Rebic, WGN News.